Welcome back to English 4.0, the radio show. Let's go! Advanced. All right, thank you, and welcome back. Yes, welcome to the advanced portion of the class. And I'm here once again with my friend Susanna. Susanna, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Great, and thank you so much for coming in again. Thank you. <laughs> right. So Susanna's been here for a few programs. She's been coming back for a few days now to participate. And uh, I must say it's great to have a guest because I was really getting tired of, of, of talking to myself, right? <laughs> Nacho's laughing there as well because, yeah, he knows I'm in that room all day talking to myself. And it's much more interesting to have someone to talk to, I must say. So, Susanna, let's start with a little review. Are you ready? Yes. A little review of what we saw in the last class. We were talking about I'd rather. I'd rather. So I'd rather, and we were talking about, um, for example, I'd rather with a subject pronoun followed by the past simple. So I'd rather we made pizza. I'd rather we fixed the car instead of buying a new one, hmm. right? I'd rather he asked for permission before taking the car, for example. Okay. Now, um, I'll, I'll say a sentence and then you can give me an example. You say, no, I'd rather or he'd rather. And then okay. you can sort of invent something that's grammatically acceptable. All right? Okay. So, do you want Juan to do it? Do you want Juan to do it? No, I I want I, – no, sorry. Uh, no, I'd rather Lucia do it. I'd rather Lucia yeah, did, it. did it. Yeah, Correct. so simple past. No, I'd rather Lucia did it. I'd rather Lucia did it. Does he want us to do it? Mm, uh, no, I'd rather. But does he want to? No, he'd rather. No, he'd rather. Um, his brother did his it? His brother did it. For example, yeah. I'd rather my brother did it. He'd rather his brother did it. We'd rather... Our friends did it, right? I'd rather go – I'd rather my friends went to the game hmm. than those other people. You know, I'd rather give, I'd rather give the, the tickets to my friends, for example. Hmm. Uh, does she want us to go with her? Uh, no, she'd rather uh, her friends go with her. Went, went, went with, with her? her. He, she'd, she'd rather her friends went with her. Yes. She'd rather her friends went with her, yes. Do you want them to call you? Mm, no, I'd rather... Mm, they didn't they call? They didn't call me. I'd rather they didn't call me because it's late at night. I'd rather they didn't call me, right? Yeah, I'm trying to get some sleep. I'd ra Look, I'd rather you didn't call me after midnight because I'm trying to sleep, okay? Mm -hmm. Do you want him to leave his computer at home? Mm, no, I'd rather uh, he... Brought with him. Brought it, brought it with him, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I bring my computer here to the, uh, the office, sometimes, but not always. But uh, I'd, rather, I'd rather have my own computer than, than have to work on one upstairs. Yes. You know? Mm -hmm. Okay, anyhow, let's move on now to practice with the translation list. And yesterday, we did the first 10 And it took a while. Well, it didn't take a long time. It's just we only had about three minutes left, so I feel that we didn't do it justice. Do you know what that means? Hmm. We didn't give it the treatment that it deserves. Yes. Do you agree? Yes, I agree. Did you feel rushed yesterday? A little. Because I said, Susanna, we only have two minutes, and then we have 12 <laughs> sentences. Let's go. And it was a bit stressful. So let's try the whole list again. Okay. All right? <laughs> Yesterday, you already did the first 10, so it'll be a piece of cake, right? Yes. Pan comido, right? Piece of cake. No problem. Okay, voy a sumir. Su and I, you know, yesterday, <laughs> I didn't say that right yesterday, and I'm still not saying it right. Voy a subir mi nivel de inglés. I'm going to raise my level of English. Yeah, and I'm going to raise my level of Spanish. That's my goal <laughs> for the next year. I think I'm going to raise my level of Spanish, yes. ¿Has sumado todas las columnas? Have you added up all the columns? Have you added up all the columns? Columns. Have you added up all the columns? 
pies. The columns. Yes, I've added up all the columns. Nos quedan dos todavía. We still have two left. We still have two left. So we have a total of 12 sentences to translate, and we've just translated three of them. So how many do we have left? Um, we have a. We still have nine. Nine left. We still have nine left. Are we done? No, we're not done yet because we still have nine left, right? Mm -hmm. We still have nine left. ¿Cómo quieres que empiece yo la carta? How do you want me to start the letter? Good. And at home? Did you get that at home? How do you want me to start the letter? And it's a question. How do you want me to start the letter? Say it again, Susana. How do you want me to start the letter? How do you want me to start the letter? Good, good. Esta no es una carta cualquiera. This isn't just... No. This isn't just any letter. This isn't just any letter. Kyle, this is an important letter. This isn't just any letter, right? Yes. This isn't just any letter. Está dirigida al presidente. It's addressed to the president. Right. It's addressed to the president. Fírmalo en el reverso. Sign it on the back. Sign it. Sign it on the back. Sign it on the back. Again? Sign it on the back. Sign it on the back. Sign it on the back. All right. Si no hubiera sido por ti. If it hadn't been for you. If it hadn't been for you. Very good. If it hadn't been for you, I don't know what would have happened. <laughs> yes. If it hadn't been for you, I would have been alone today, Susan. <laughs> I would have been in talking to myself all day again. Mm. Antes de que te vayas, quiero que eches un vistazo a esto. Before you leave, I want you to take a look at this. Before you leave, I want you to take a look at this. Take a look. Echar un vistazo, right? Mm -hmm. To take a look. Before you leave, I want you to take a look at this. 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 This, right? With the tongue at this. Very good. Before you leave, I want you to take a look at this. Good. And number 10. Quiero que me cuentes la historia completa. De principio a fin. I want you to tell me the whole story from beginning to end. Nice. Very good. I want you to tell me the whole story from beginning to end. The whole thing. Mm -hmm. Don't omitir any details. How do you say that? Don't? Don't. I don't know. Don't leave out. Leave out, yes. Don't leave out any details. I want you to tell me the whole story from beginning to end. Mm. No, no se nos permite utilizar esos programas. We are not, we are not allow, allowed to use the, those programs. We're not allowed to use those programs, right. We're not allowed to use those programs. Va a haber otra reorganiza reorganización. There's going to be another reorganization. There's going to be. There's going to be another reorganization. Reorganization. Again? There's going to be another reorganization. Yes. There's going to be another reorganization. We're going to reorganize things. There's going to be another reorganization. Very good. Very good. No problem, right? No. Was it easy? Not too easy. Not, 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 not too easy, but I think it was good. Okay, so let's move on now. I think we've had enough translation. Let's move on, okay? Yes, okay. Expression of the day. All right, it's time now for our expression of the day. The expression of the day today is a good one. Susanna, and there are a number of expressions. I'm sure you have several in Spanish that mean this. In English, we say beggars can't be choosers. Do you know what a beggar is? Someone who begs. Someone who begs. Yes. Please give me money. Give me money. Someone who begs. A beggar. So the expression is beggars can't be choosers. So what, what does that mean? Mm. It's kind of self-explanatory, yes. right? If you if you you know if you don't have the, the the right or the ability to, well if you're you know if you're getting something for free, yes, then don't be so selective, right? Do you have a similar ex expression in Spanish? Mm. 
beggars can't be choosers. I can't think of any. No. We also say in English, we, we say, don't sniff, sniff, like to smell. <laughs> don't sniff a gift fish. Mm. Someone gives you a fish and you're not going to smell. Oh, well, I'm only going to take it if it's fresh and delicious. No, no, it's free. It's a gift, right? So don't criticize something that comes for free is the expression, essentially. Beggars can't be choosers. Or don't sniff a gift fish, right? Mm -hmm. So there you go, our expression of the day. Beggars can't be choosers. Can you say it one more time? Beggars can't be choosers. Beggars can't be choosers. That's right. Very good. All right. Now we're going to move on with a little more would rather. But this is the night. This is the more fun way to practice it. Would you rather between two options, all right? Okay. So here we can find out a few things. Would you rather go to a football match or an opera? I would rather go to a football match. Okay, so I would rather infinitive. <laughs> I'd rather go to a football match, yeah? Yes. Have you ever been to an opera? Yes. Did you like it? Yes, I like it, but I'd rather go to a football match. Okay, would you rather go to a football match in the Calderon or in the Bernabeu? I'd rather... Uh, go to a football match in the Bernabeu. Okay, all right. So I would rather plus infinitive. What? No two, right, Susanna? Right. Right. That's what we have to remind the listeners at home. Mm -hmm. No two. I would rather two. Ooh, never, never. I would rather go. I would rather. Would you rather eat chicken or fish for dinner? I'd rather for, for lunch. I'll say for lunch. I'd rather eat chicken. Okay. All right. Um, okay. A few more questions here. Would you rather have a headache or a sore back? Uh, I'd rather have a headache. Yeah. A sore back can be mm. very, yes. very, very, very annoying. Mm -hmm. Yes. I've ra I'd rather have a headache too. Mm. So it doesn't have – they don't have to be good alternatives, right? They're both negative. But if I had to have one or the other, I'd rather have a headache than a sore back. Mm. Would you, this is a terrible question, but <laughs> would you rather be blind or deaf? Um, I'd rather be deaf. Yeah, you'd rather be deaf than blind? Yes. Yeah. Okay. But, uh, yeah, it's tricky. It's difficult. That's tough. That's a tough decision. I, I always used to say that I would rather be blind or be, be deaf. But the thing is, if you're deaf, then you're probably, you know, you, 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 your ability to, to communicate is... But you can learn... Sign sex. language, yes. yeah. But then you can only communicate with people that, that, that can read it and can, you know, yeah. it's difficult. Yes. I don't know. That's a tough, that's a tough choice, really. <laughs> Anyhow, would you rather be speaking on the radio or listening to the radio? I'd rather be speaking on the radio. Yeah, it's fun, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, would you rather live in an igloo or a mansion? I'd rather live in a mansion. In a mansion, yes. I think it's more comfortable. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> would you rather drive a new sports car or an old beater? Do you know what an old beater is? An old beater means an old... A car that's not in very good shape. It's kind of deteriorating. An old beater. Okay. I'd Would you rather drive a new sports car or an old beater? I'd rather drive a new sport car. Sports car. Sports car. Sure, sure. Okay. Would you rather have a diamond or a bag of feathers? I'd rather have a diamond. 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 All right. She'd rather have a diamond. Yeah, me too. A bag of feathers <laughs> no. isn't so good. No. I have a pillow on my bed that's basically a bag of feathers, but I'd rather have a diamond. Sure. <laughs> All right. Vocabulary of the day. All right. Yes, it is time for our vocabulary of the day. Uh-huh. Carterista. Carterista. Am I saying that right? Yes. Yeah, carterista. I'm carterista. on the metro. Oh, ma mm. where'd my wallet go? I think the... Pocket. Ah, I think and what I think the pickpocket took it. He picked my pocket. <laughs> yes. right? A pickpocket, yeah. Carterista. Like a wallet wallet ist. <laughs> yes. But but we don't <laughs> say that in, in English. No, oh, a, a pickpocket, okay. Yes. Fiabilidad. Mm, real, mm, reliability. Reliable Reliability. Reliability. 
Is reliability important when you're choosing a car? Yes, of course. Yeah, reliability. You have to get a reliable vehicle. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Astuto. Shrewd. Mm. Shrewd. Are you are you familiar with that word? Shrewd. Shrewd. Did you see my list, Susanna? <laughs> no. I have my list here, and I think she may have seen it. But 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 maybe maybe you remember it from when you studied the list before, right? Sh yes. But shrewd, astuto, shrewd. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, repugnante, nauseabundo. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Sickening. 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 We say mm -hmm. sickening. Yes. Escéptico. Skeptical. 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 If I told you that you could learn English in one day, would you be skeptical? Yes. <laughs> she would be very skeptical. I would be very skeptical of anyone who made that sort of promise. Yes. Okay. So, um, okay. I'm after after this class. Are you going to go home? Yes. You're going to go home. Can you just repeat that? Yes, I'm going to go home. She's going to go home. I'm going to go home too. After class, I'm going to go home. We are going to go – well, we're, we're going to finish the program now because we're completely out of time. But I want to thank you so much for listening. But we will be back tomorrow because I have to go home. This is the next point coming up in the class, but we'll review it tomorrow. <laughs> we keep running out of time, but that's fine. We'll be back tomorrow, same time, same place. Thank you so much, Susanna. Thank you, Kai. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.